Good afternoon, viewers, and welcome to Physics and Mathematics Lovers. Today, I shall be taking you on mathematics with the topic subtraction of numbers using lattice method. We have explained lattice method in previous videos. You know what lattice method all about. Now, let's go. Before you do that, please, let's somebody share this video. Don't forget, like the video, also comment. Make a comment, bring question if you want us to solve together. Now, let's go to the question. The question says, subtract 2986 from 4213. So, this is how you do it. You arrange your box. This is your box. Each of them stands for a digit. Look at them. Then, on the top, at the top here, you draw your diagonal line. Here is different from what other uh, multiplication, multiplication or addition. This is where your diagonal will be. How do you do that? Your diagonal will be up. Down is for your answer. Let's go. Here, 3 minus 6. It is impossible. Because of that, you stroke it. Bring it here. Put it 3 there. Now, let's look for somebody that will borrow us. We move to this place. We take this one. Because you have taken this one, nothing is left here. You bring here. You are left with nothing. So what is remaining here is what zero. You place it here. You bring the one that you just well, borrowed. Place it up here. So here, you have taken it. You will stroke it. What is left here is zero. Bring the zero up here. Now, this becomes 13 minus what, 6. 13 minus 6 gives you what? 7. Place it there. Then we move to this place. It becomes here, 8. 0 and 8 here. You cannot remove 8 from 0. It's impossible. You move to this very one. Come and meet this one here. Take one. When you take one from here, you are left with one in this place. The one that you are left with, place it here. The one you just took, put it here. It becomes what? 10. I get it now. So 10 minus 8 gives you 2. What is left here is 1. 1 minus 9 is impossible. Then you move to this side. When you move to this side, come and take one here. When you take one, you are left with what? 3. Place it 3 here. Then the one that you just took, place it here. So it becomes 11 minus 9 gives you two here becomes zero because that is for the 10 we are left with what three here three minus two gives you one so at the end of the day when i subtract four two one three minus two nine eight six it will give me equal to one two two seven that is the answer. Thank you so much. Do not forget to share this video. If you have questions also, bring it. And make sure you comment to this video. As you do so, God will bless you.